Ladies and gentlemen, I bring you the choir. <laughs> In the previous episode, uh, what happened? Um, left the torture chambers, came here, and you know that doesn't seem to constitute towards a full ten minutes as it goes. Oh god. Oh, what are these? Hello? Oh my, oh my lord, thank you, I love that. Oh no, it's an operating apparatus. Ah, oh, hang on. Ah, uh, gotta change my status to busy. Come on, change, there we go, excellent. Sweet, it's because I've got my laptop set up next to my uh, thingy. After the men had secured the prisoner, the ritual began. Okay, so the ritual began. Ritual. So they got one of these, and they were like, Kapa! Kapa! Burr! And then they just dropped the thing on the ground, and then they were like, Quick! Grab the bucket! And they... They put it over his head, and then they... They picked up another knife, and then they were like, Can you hear this? And he was like, No, because I'm dead. And then the bucket fell off. And then they picked up these tongs. And they decided to tickle his feet with them, and then they dropped them on the ground. And they picked up a saw, and they hit him in the stomach with the handle. And... Then they got a hammer, and um, using the uh, the sharp part, they, well, I don't know, they did something, and it caused a load of blood. So, there you go. Rituals in 60 seconds with Danny Cleary at DVXC Gaming. Oh, God. Oh, God, there's another, 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 a note. Another room? Handled. This is no choir. This is ritualistic slaughtering. Uh, uh, what is? They, they got the chisel, and they they did something with the chisel. I don't know. Oh God! What? Of August, 1839. The blood wards are failing. The shadow beckons, and its cry disarms my actions. Oh God! Hurry, no time to spare. You have to kill another. Alexander produces a knife. He wants me to cut the flesh. Do it. Save yourself. He is a murderer, Daniel. He is evil. A cold-blooded killer. You hurry, dude. You are so screwed. See this net? You must let me be. I have to concentrate. Pen the man, cut the lines, cut the flesh, watch the blood spill, let it come. Paint the man, cut the lines. Um, man, you are screwed. Please, I didn't do anything. Oh. Paint the man, cut the lines, paint the man, cut the lines. Please, the man cries. Ah, ah. How you sleep. Oh. I did well. One life for another. You hear me, guardian of the orb? I did all this for you. Now, once more, withdraw your shadow from my domain. Oh god, what now? Why is it so dark? Alexander, there isn't much time. I can feel it. We must act swiftly. I will do whatever it takes. What the? What the hell just happened? Well, Daniel didn't use a chisel. I am... Quite um 
Disappointed as it goes. Anything for me in here? No. Ah. So now I know why my friend was chanting paint the lion, uh, paint the man, cut the lions. Then have sex with his uh, dead and unyielding body. Except she didn't say that. As it happens. That was probably just me imagining that part. Choir main hall. Oh great, so there's more choir. Excellent. It's just, the fear had begun to drown him again. He reached once more for the empty bottle of laudanum. In frustration, he smashed it against the bedpost. Again. Because I'm pretty sure I've already said that one. What on earth is... What are my intentions, Daniel? Salvation. It used to be yours, but now you only seek misplaced revenge. How do you justify your violence? Is it for the greater good? Are you doing the world a service? It is you who caused all this pain and death. If you had accepted your fate and submitted to the orb when you first discovered it, None of this would have happened. It is curiosity in league with your selfishness that is killing us both. You offered me help, old man! Oh god. This place is horrible. Why well, is the loading screen music? Oh, what do I do? Oh great, flies everywhere! Oh god! Where is he? Where is he? Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up, pick it up, pick it up! Where is that whalish bastard? Oh my god! Oh god! Oh god! I don't like this. Where are you, you f Okay, I, you know what? Don't answer that question. Oh my god. This is horrible. Have I got to find three of these? Oh my god. The wheel is good for keeping your victim still during the procedure. They can be bound around the circumference or simply stretched across, tying limbs to the spokes and rim. All tools are by this point useful, and you may administer the torture in any way you like. But the forte of the wheel is the gaps. When you have decided that the victim shall die, you can smash their limbs with a hammer, making them fold in between the frame. Oh, but they'll die. Too quickly, I mean. No, don't worry. The human body is much more resilient. They can survive for days until they finally succumb. He sounds like Vincent Price. Is that his name? Vincent Price. Oh my god. Oh great, oh great, ringing, oh god Daniel, ringing, I think I've got to go, anyway, right, I'm going to save it here, oh god, thank you very much for watching this episode of Amnesia the Dark Descent, 
where I've just discovered that my suspicions about the choir being horrible are true. I'm really tempted to look up a walkthrough, but purely for your guys' uh, enjoyment, I shan't. And I hate you for it. Ah, so the next episode will be annotated in the top right hand corner of this video. The previous video will be annotated in the top left hand corner. Click subscribe for a notification when my next video upload and I'll see you guys in the next video.